have any fours? Nope. Do you have any sevens? Yep. I miss playing guitar for everyone. It was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? Since the attack, there's a lot we don't do anymore. We shouldn't have let that guy go. Boyd would still be alive and everything would be the same. Boyd agreed it was the right thing to do. Anyway, Roman's obsessed with keeping this place secured now. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time, Roman isn't taking any chances. And he should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Did anyone see you leave? No, no one saw me. You've got to stop doing that. You're going to get us both in a lot of trouble. I don't see why it's such a big deal. We had another break-in just last month. Ugh, Becca, you know what it means if someone were to see you and follow you back here. No one is following me. There's no one else out there. Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. Give us a minute. Yeah. Just don't take too long. What was that all about? I don't know. Probably not good, though. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. Joyce, do you know what's going on? I don't know if I should say anything. Please, what is it? They caught Stephanie stealing and then trying to escape. Oh, my God. What are they going to do? I don't know. What can we do? I'll go talk to Roman. We'll figure it out. really necessary. Roman? Good. You're here. I heard about Stephanie. I'm sorry. What are you gonna do? You know what we do. What happened? We caught her trying to escape. Maybe she wasn't. Maybe she just wanted to get outside these walls for a while. Ever since the incident, you've made this place feel, I don't know, oppressive. We've made it safe. She was definitely trying to escape. She had most of our ammo and medicine with her. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? matters to me. You and Boyd were the ones who fought to let that guy go. Convinced us all to take that chance. Well, we did. And it was wrong. And now Boyd is dead. We're beyond the luxury of taking chances now. And I need to know that you're with us 100%. But she's one of us. Th this is different. No, she's not. Not anymore. 
She tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo. She knew that could mean the death of any one of us. You got your gun? It's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. God, what do I tell Becca? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. Shell? What's wrong? Am I in trouble? It's Stephanie. She stole a bunch of supplies and tried to escape. Oh my god. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? She's just scared. She made a mistake. That'll be her last mistake. Becca, Stephanie is your friend. Was my friend. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there, in the drawer. I don't want this to be who we are. Just let me do it then. No, I'll do it. You shouldn't ever have to do something like this. I just need a second. This really sucks. Yeah, it does. You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. Shell, it's time. What are you doing? Shell? Shell, what the hell? Sit down, get safe. Shell, hey! Shell, we'll be safe. Oh. Like 60 miles left, I think. Ain't shit. Ah, I missed the days of taking shortcuts.
I see you cuddling with your girlfriend down there. Shit, bro. I don't want no trouble. Please. You just want to be left alone with your friend down there? No, just leave me alone. Look, I don't care what you do to whatever corpse you find. I wasn't. What's your name? Don't matter. What? You don't like the name Russell? Well, maybe that's just the name of the guy you or your homies robbed, huh? I don't care who you steal from, if you did. Maybe you're in a gang that likes to rob people. I don't know. Are you in a crew? You got some boys wearing hoodies I gotta worry about? Because you steal from me and I'll get your throat out. I don't care who you run around with, you understand? It's mine. I didn't steal it. All right, good. I don't like thieves. Just get in the car. You're gonna get eaten out here otherwise and I'm bored. Come on, scoot. Ain't gonna wait forever. Fine. Fuck, see if I give a shit. You take me to Statesboro? Trying to get to my grand's house. Fuck, she like the party? Just get in, we'll get there. Or somewhere, eventually. <laughs> Name's Nate, by the way, thanks for asking. You thirsty? Uh. Here you go. I'm straight, thanks. You're not uptight, are you? Is this the fucking apocalypse? This is like nothing. No, I'm just good, all right? All right, all right. You want to tell me about where you come from, at least? Must have been with a crew. Any tailback where you come from? Maybe drop you off, do a double back. Sure, yeah. I mean, I'll tell you about who I was with. Don't leave out any juicy deets, all right? Huh. Uh, okay. There were seven of us. I didn't have any family there or nothing. They were all at my grand's down in Statesboro. There was a dad who had a daughter about my age. One guy said he used to be a cop, but nobody really believed him. Then a teacher and his wife. The leader was this guy, Steve. Go back to the daughter. Steve was a bad dude, but everybody was with him, you know? He said seven was the magic number, so we didn't add nobody to the group. If we found survivors, it was the same every time. He... He... Let it out, Paco. Just... We gonna kill these folks and take this stuff or what? Then bang! They'd be dead! Anyway, I, I couldn't handle that. After weeks of it, I packed my shit up and figured I could make for Grands alone and try to find my family. I slipped out of there. I couldn't live like that. So nobody got down with the daughter then? No, they didn't. What would you give her? Strong six? Just tell me something about her. How was the rack? Give me a little something. Just a taste. Russ, I'm doing you a service here. I gotta get my beak wet. I put it right in here. Why you gotta be like that? Like what? Always talking about women like that. Women? <laughs> okay, well, let, let me see if I can answer your question. Because, because the hunger a man's got for a woman is all we got left now. No laws, no jobs, ain't nothing that make us men. But they ain't eating all the women yet. Whatever. Let's try this again. All right, maybe someone who wasn't so near and dear to your heart then. What the fuck? Come on, scale of one to ten. What do you think? Ah, slamming before she was done, right? What do you think? Here, get a look. Fuck! Like a nine, right? Get off me! Maybe you got high standards. If you say five, I'm gonna flip. Tell me, Russ. Ten, okay? Ten, you psycho! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Would you load that? Bullets in the glove there.
look for some supplies in here. See if we can fill up while we're at it. Don't be mad. Fine, be mad. Just stop being a pussy. Alright. Oh shit! Go! Get out! Russ! Get the fuck down, man! You don't want to be there! Get to the truck! I'll cover you! I'll get fucking shot! No, you won't! I'll cover you! This guy can't hit the broadside of a barn! Just move your ass! Good hustle. What happened to I'll cover you? Look how good you did. Alright, what are we gonna do? First, we're gonna figure out exactly where this asshole is. Just get a quick glance. Come on, just a peek. Just down. See? Easy. Now we know where he is, we can fucking get him. Alright, yeah. That's the spirit. Let's push this truck for cover. Okay. It's in neutral. Just keep your head down. Shit! Just keep pushing! Shit! Push! Uh, end of the road. What now? We're gonna get around the side of the building. We gotta go from cover to cover. Seriously, this time. I'm not fucking around. You gonna cover me? If we get to that car, we'll be out of the line of fire. Here. You can cover me first. I'm not fucking around. You cover me, then I'll cover you. Or if you wanna go first, that's fine too. Shoot at the window and keep that fucker's head down till I get where I'm going. Then throw me the gun, and I'll do the same. Ready? Yeah. You ready, Russ? Cover my ass now. Remember, don't stop shooting. Fire! All right, throw me the gun, and I'll cover you. down to your grams and have a big old home-cooked meal, all right? Come on. Watch out for that. What's the problem? We should put it out of its misery. It's fucking dead. Come on. Feel like a big man now? Let's go. Okay, it's clear. Keep your head down and follow me. You got it. All right. We're gonna be fucking quiet. We're gonna sneak. 
sneak up on this son of a bitch and take him out. You hear me? Not a fucking beep. Let's go. I see him. Check through the window. See if there's anyone else. I think I saw a guy. No shit. Grab him. I'll cover you. Do I sneak up? Just jump out and grab him. Your call. Monsters! Whoa, Gramps! I told you not to come back here! Think you could just leave your mask at home? And now you're with this fucking spook! First off, watch the fucking racism. This is my boy. Secondly, I don't fucking know you. We were just passing by like anyone else. Bullshit! You came back to finish us off and take all our food! You've lost your goddamn marbles. She's dying, and now she can see your face. Shut up. She can see who took her from me. We've never been here, sir. Then who shot my wife? Wasn't us. You tried to kill us for no goddamn reason. If anything, we should take you out for that. Please, just get the fuck out of here. Please leave us alone. What do you say, Russ? Should we just kill these folks and take all their stuff? Are you serious? Maybe. Why not? That's fucked up! There are real fucking monsters out there! No shit. And you're just gonna joke about the shit I see. Fuck you, Nate. I saved your ass. You didn't do shit. Easy, Russ. I'm not hurting no one. And don't you hurt these people either. Come on. Can we still be friends? No. Okay, got one. A snake for a tongue. You are so bad at this. Would you rather have a snake for a tongue? Oh. Or lobster claws for hands? I swear, this is the worst one ever. You know the rules, miss. Gotta answer. Well? I'm thinking. Think harder. And how exactly do you think harder? Good point. I'll think about that. Neither? That's not really an answer. You don't set the rules around here. Well, that's a fact. Okay. Uh, how about... Uh, never mind. Uh, I probably ought to stop bugging you with stupid hypotheticals. Oh, come on. You'd be a lot less fun. You've been a lot more fun lately. Feeling better? I guess I am. Well, you sure do look better. But, uh... You gotta admit, anything is an improvement. That came out wrong. Uh, what I mean is... I mean, uh, you were... You were, uh... You know. Thanks, jerk. Hey, that's what I'm here for. Oh, to remind me how hideous I was. Nah. Make sure you keep on keeping on. I mean it, though. After we found you, you were still so hooked on that stuff. Well, I never thought you'd make it. You ain't out of the woods yet, I know, but... Well, you've come a long way, Bonnie. And I'm proud of you. You're a good friend, Leland. I know. Okay, you're not that great. Look, 
You know I ain't going nowhere, right? As long as we're together, I'll be there for you. You ain't gotta worry. You know that, right? Slow down, Leland. Bonnie, yeah. Leland? Bonnie? D. Hey, honey. I found us something. What are you two up to? Just chatting. Chatting, huh? What about? Oh, uh, well, um, lobsters. Lobsters? Well, fishing. Figured it'd be worth a shot for the food, you know. Leland, you hate fishing. Well, that ain't totally true. And how many days you gone fishing? What? I go fishing all the time. Thought you, didn't I? I am a catch. Don't I know it. I got you a present. Oh, you shouldn't have. What'd you find? I'll tell you later. I don't mean to interrupt your chat with your uh, girlfriend, but uh, we gotta get moving. Girlfriend. So, where'd you get the bag, Dee? Dee? Dee, did you hear me? What's in the bag, Dee? I told you, it's a surprise. Hey, Dee, when we get back to camp, would you let me borrow some of that nail polish? Sure, hon. You like this color? It's my favorite. And after today, I could use a new coat, you know? Same here. I feel like a drowned rat with these claws. Not to interrupt the girl talk here, but uh, Dee, that, that bag. Look, I found it down the road a piece, all right? Where down the road? Some place off that away. Damn it, Dee, you gotta give us more than that. Did you steal it? What? The Bonnie's right. If, if you stole that bag, we need to know. You don't gotta make no big deal out of it. You guys sure gang up on me a lot lately. Honey, that ain't true. Tell me one time you sided with me in the last week. The last month. All right. I can't remember one especially, but I know I have. False. This is how all our fights go. Every time. Now we're standing here in the woods, soaking through, and for what? Don't you want to get to the camp before dark? I ain't the one who stopped. We should get but moving But you are the now. one Come who on, made me stop. Irregardless, we could just as easy carry on like this while we're walking. Oh, I've about had it with that attitude. Attitude? And now we're standing in this goddamn rain. I'm going to leave you both here in the middle of nowhere you place. That on purpose. You listen to me now. I have had it up to I here with listening to you. To blaspheme. I can't believe you are still real. Oh, forget the both of you. I'm leaving. Don't leave, please. He can sort this out. Oh, Lord, give me strength. We'll straighten this out. We will. Right, Dee? We, we can solve this out. We just need to get somewhere else. Oh, now you agree with me. Bonnie, darling, I'm, I'm sorry we're... Darling? Dee, come on. Save it. I know what side your bread is buttered on. Yours, too. Dee, now's not the time. Whatever issues we got, we'll hash them out later. It's always later. I, I refuse to get in the middle of this. Well, too bad. You already are. I'm sorry. I just want to get somewhere where I can change my clothes, and then you and your girlfriend can... Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, God, run. Come on. We gotta move. What are you talking about? Oh, shit.
anything? Where the hell are they? Anything? No, I can't see a damn thing out here.
we were right. There are survivors out here. Still alive? Well, they're gonna be happy to get rescued. So how many are we talking about? Around five, I think. They left a note, so at least we know they want to be found. And I can see smoke in the distance. Probably a camp. I'm gonna try to make contact tonight. Great. Well, just be careful and use your best judgment. We're building a good community here. We want to keep it that way. Of course. So good. I'm gonna try to talk to him. Wish me luck. Yeah, good luck. Be careful. Don't try to force him into anything. Just get as many of them as you can. You got it. Hey! Don't fit! Don't fucking move! Who the fuck are you? My name is Tavia. How did you find us? I found your note. I'm a scout for a growing settlement up north. We go out and look for survivors to rescue them. We have food, clean water, and shelter for everyone. We're offering you a chance to help us out and start over. God, this sounds too good to be true, but I think it is. Bonnie, get real. Just because you have to tell the truth all the time doesn't mean everyone else does. If I didn't trust people, I'd be dead. I know that for sure. People can care about you if you let them. Like Leland cared when he let you run off alone? That's enough, Becca. I heard rumors about these places. This guy I was traveling with ditched me trying to find one in his own. He thought... You know what? Let's do this. She looks well fed, right? And clean? We could all use a meal and a hot shower. Wait, you find survivors? Do you find a lot? Not as many anymore, but... Well, we gotta go. Eddie might be there. Wyatt. Look, we need people. Plain and simple. You folks can decide if you want to come as a group, or split up, or whatever. But I don't want to be out here in the open after dark. So in a few minutes, I'm gonna be getting back in my car and on my way. Hopefully, at least some of you will follow me. Well, I'm going. Maybe we should go too, sis. If Roman is still looking for us, he wouldn't be able to do anything to us there. There's no way that guy is still looking for you. We've been to that truck stop. There's no one left. Roman's not a problem. It's following her that'll get you killed. Look, I know it's a risk, but what else is there? If you guys are going, then so are we. I don't like this, guys. We should just walk away. I don't trust her. Of course you don't, Russell. You don't trust anyone. I'm not lying to you. How do we know that? You don't. You don't have to come, but we'd be happy to have you. I don't understand what the problem is. Are you really considering staying out here? Foraging for food like fucking raccoons? I mean, then why did we even leave the photos there? Well, it could be a trap. What if they want to kill us? Thank you. Everyone out there is batshit crazy. We've all seen it. Well, we turned out all right, didn't we? Relatively speaking. What are we gonna do? Eat you? Are you gonna eat us? No, that was a joke. I'm sorry. Look, I know you guys are wary, and you have every right to be. You don't know me from a hole in the ground. And yeah, there are some crazy fuckers out there. All I'm here to do is make an offer. You can come with me, or you can stay here. The choice is yours. So, who wants to come with me? Yeah. I'm going. Yeah. I have to. I'm... I'm just not sure. We've been out here for so long and seen so much bullshit. 
But is it really worth getting our hopes up? Of course it is, Russell. Hope is all we've got left. But being smart, that's what's keeping us alive. Some of you may have been separated from friends or family. It's a long shot, but there's a chance you could find them there. Have your people been through Statesboro? Yes, I think we have. Okay, but I swear to God, if you try anything, you're gonna regret it. We'll do everything we can to help you find your friends and family. But understand that I can't promise anything. We understand. I think we've all made up our minds. Well, I guess we have our group. What do you want to do with these? This is a good thing. I know it is. How do we know this will work out? I give you my word. 